like to practice more parries. Oh, that's cool. I often practice at the mission. Care to join me? Okay. I'll be in the sanctuary San Drago. Wait for a gift to give it to someone special. Who was like a gourmet cupcake recipe? Ooh, that looks cool though. Give it to someone special. Chemistry design recipe. Okay, so I can't really give anything else right now, so I won't worry about it. Okay, let's leave. What's going here? You spend time at the Low Rosa Sunder. After a bit of dancing, you're both in charge of the VIP. Hey, let's get to know each other better. Ask me anything beautiful. What do you do? You really love dancing, huh? So you're a dancing scimitar? Uh huh. You know it. I have this place with Mandy. Well, she owns most of it. I make do with the scraps. Life is for a living, right? So why work? I'd rather have a good time. Dance floor. Do more damage when surrounded. Finish yourself have a larger attack area. So I spend most nights uh, dancing. I'm glad you're here. I only have eyes for you, you know. Center so meets your gaze with an intensity that makes you blush. His focus is broken by his phone chirping while he looks at it briefly and puts uh. away. I'll be right back, beautiful. Don't go anywhere, all right? He smiles and leaves towards the bathroom. Anyway, it's probably only been a few minutes, but it feels like he's gone for a long time. You feel an itch, a hunch, a suspicion. Maybe made of nothing but jealousy. Check the bathroom and wear it. Oh, just ignore it for now. I see down the feeling as best as you can watching the dance floor and sun. Your gut feels tight and hot with tension. To you tell yourself not to be paranoid. Now yeah, I'll, I'll trust him. A few more minutes, Sunder. Looking more than ever, he but he mm. stopped short. Oh, you look tense. Did something happen that I should know about? Should I kick someone out? You were gone a long time. Oh, I was sorry about that, but I'm not lying to you. At least not anything important. Uh, nothing I could about. Were you low? Where, where were you? Nowhere. Uh, like the bathroom mostly. I mean, also I was in the alley, but for just she was nobody. I swear. Just chill out a little, okay? We have so much fun together. I want to make you feel special because you are- I like you a lot, like, a mm. lot, a lot. But also, sometimes I want to kiss other people, and I'm sorry if that hurts. Wait, what? <laughs> just don't lie to me. Let's just be friends. I miss- oh, this you're gonna find a sharper blade, cutie, but you're lost. It's fine. We can still have fun together as friends. I'll do right by you, so don't trust me. Would you like to offer a gift? Sure. Oh, thank you. I like this in it. I like you too. Yeah. It's like, I'm a one weapon type of girl. <laughs> I'm kind of like, I don't know, kind of. I mean, personally, I'm playing the field as well, so I'm just kind of like, I'm not too worried about it. Hey, thanks for coming last night. You're my favorite dance partner. X, my, you're my favorite too. I have to think. Uh... You're my favorite too. <laughs> Let's see. Oh wow, it's already one o'clock in the morning, jeez. Foundy, you probably met her already. Who is it? Go to Paradise Lost tomorrow and she'll meet you there. She'll wear a blue jacket. Oh, great. And don't forget to smile. Hmm, the fake smiles are bad. Never smiling option. I'm a little curious, so what's up? Welcome to Paradise Lost. I'm Olivia. What kind of cats do you like? The friendly kind, the fluffy kind, all of them. I like all That's of them. not a real answer, you know. But it's true that every cat deserves love. Hmm. Don't you work at cooks? <laughs> oh, that's neat. Doesn't have to be. We can just hang out and pet cats. I don't really like dates anyway. Hmm. Just play some game of trying to guess the right thing to say. I feel that, and then you flirt, and you're supposed to start kissing. It's all fake. I totally understand. What about dating stories? Kissing's fun. I try to be sincere. 
Hey, or are you just playing a dating game? We'll never know. All of you have frowned slightly. I is focusing the distance. I don't look behind you, but I think someone's watching us in the window. You pick from the- but you don't see anyone. Hmm, there maybe I was imagining things. An elegant cat walks up- Ah, it looks like the cat from Disney. <laughs> She's staring at you curiously. I don't recognize this one. Who are you, kitty? Are you new here? She's so cute. May I pet you, perhaps? Elvia reaches her hand tentatively, but the cat stalks away till in the air. I guess I offended her. Spend some time chatting and petting cats. That was nice to see you around. Can I walk you home? Uh, wanna meet up again? You want me to- Uh, huh. You're a little too intense for me to be- Okay, no problem. I can dial it. What do you mean? Okay, no problem. Um, so if any of my friends- I'll let you know. She backs out of the cafe with a blush. The cat gives you a pitying look. This is your fault. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. <laughs> cat stares at you feel uncomfortable. <laughs> you at home. <laughs> what the fuck? Is he stalking me? Oh, no, no, no. We're friends, maybe. Oh, sweet. Friends are the best. This is progress. Just think a few weeks ago you never dated anyone. Now you have experience and skills. If you want to change up your weapon compass, check out the gym in town and the most romantic holiday ever is around the corner. Uh... Valentine's? No, silly. Fourth of July. Nothing's more romantic than barbecue and fireworks. Of course. You think I'm joking, but wait and see. I met my partner, Samantha. Barbecue is gold. You'll be all. I'll send you details soon. What did it? I know I've been there, I know it feels to be rejected. They think they're so much better than us. But they're not, you're better than all of them. You deserve to be treated like a queen. It's, it's okay, thanks. Uh, um, uh, it's okay. Sorry if I'm awkward or say too much. Yeah, you're just so pretty. <sighs> it really reminds me of people that I've actually dealt with in my real life. I'm just like, <laughs> <laughs> Take the hit. <laughs> I guess I could just say please stop, but I know this is me in real life. I normally try and be like nice. I don't try to be like a dick. So he was stalking when I did that, but like. Oh, that's neat. Paradise Lost. Church Sanctuary makes a surprisingly good combat training space. Wait, you fight in the church? You're improving, but your parry is actually a bit too consistent. You could try a bit slower or faster or try a new parry direction. Surprise is the spice of life. If Vincent, go on, take a stab at it. Parry quickly, parry diagonally, throw your weapon. Throw your weapon. <laughs> right. Yeah, just like that perfect form, just lovely. You have a perfect form too, are you flirting with me? Oh? Well, I'm not even wielding. Oh, you mean. Oh, well, thank you. Uh, let's resume. <laughs> you practice parodies and lunches for a while. Nice hey, work, you even have me sweating. I'm just getting start on guard. You launch into it and you get the spare ninja. So let's see, he deflects, oh. Was that fire? <laughs> he deflects every thrust easily, knocking them aside and scoring on you. Have mercy, wow, you're amazing. <laughs> Let's see what he does. He's like, yes, so boy, I'm sorry. I hope I didn't frustrate you. I just wanted to see your true level. When we learn most, we are challenged after all. I like this music a lot, I'm not gonna lie. This is pretty... Let's see, I didn't mean to show up. I get impatient sometimes, I suppose. You handled me rather well, I must say. Disengage. Mm -hmm. We can continue or take a break. How are you feeling? Why are we in a church? Your fencing gear suits you. He takes off it looking around. My mother raised me in this church. It's a comforting place. She wasn't as kind as your mother, it sounds like, but she did some things right. 
She came from the community mostly, but I took it more deeply. There are so many mysteries in this life. Some people suffer, others become mm -hmm. swords. Purpose is helpful. Do you believe in God? Uh, yeah, I do. Then you understand. I hope they'll learn something greater. Our beliefs are probably quite different, but at least we can agree that love is power, not just lust. Real generous, patient mm -hmm. love. I like to think that love can connect everyone no matter what deity we believe in or don't. There's so many suffering people and help them all. Oh, that's so sweet. I know you like talking business. I see it more as a powerful tool. I started Brooks Associate to tackle wealth and inequality, but most wealthy people aren't interested. Aw, he releases a long exal ex exaltation, shaking his head. Anyway, I wanted to thank you for handling my father so gracefully before. I totally did not use drop. Vincent can be a difficult man, lots of saber rattling. We all have our bad days. He's a businessman too. Why don't you stand up to him? Uh. Isaac Crown's looking away. He wants what he thinks is best for me, so perhaps I should try to say something. But no matter how sharp I get, I can never get a word in, edgewise. How do you work up the courage to go into the dungeon even when you're afraid? I just plunge in. Your dad's a dungeon monster? <laughs> I just plunge oh. in. Yeesh, I tried that with Vincent once as a teenager. It did not end well. I think I still have a scar on my hilt from that scalpel. It was an accident, but still. We all have our own strategies for survival. Even in human form, I find it easier to parry than to go on the offense. Crowd starts filtering. Perhaps the service oh. will start soon. Oh, out of time we already have flights. Next time we'll make sure we don't get interrupted. Would you like to offer a gift? I don't think I have anything that he would like. I don't know if he likes cupcakes. I head home. Oh, why do you keep hooking me up with dates? They don't go well. Swords only. Uh, honestly, sweet. Okay, well, that was a trick question because this dude is buff and sweet. His name's Jonah and he's the best. How do you know? You date him then? Um, how do you know? We used to date a while back. Way before Samantha. He was really fun. He'd be a good friend, I think, no matter what happens. Okay, I'm in love with someone else. Don't want to date your ex. Uh, will I meet Samantha? Of course. Talk to you. Sure you'd be okay with that, because you sure do talk about her a lot. That's normally not a good sign when you talk about your ex a lot. I'm so pleased with your progress. What's the right emoji to use? Uh. Well, that's really. I think that. Okay. Let's let us go to the dungeon. All right, cool beans. Let's see. Hey, hello, cinnamon. How are you? I saw you're both on. Oh, neat. Awesome, me saucy. Okay. I don't have any new clothes, right? Okay, it doesn't look like it. Can I craft any new things? Not at the moment, I guess. Let's see, let's leave. Jesus. Expensive. I want to do more unboxing videos because I honestly genuinely enjoy them. I guess let's go to a dungeon. Let's go. I guess let's start on level five. Fear of change. Verona Mall has seen better days, huh? Probably. Finally, a monster free zone. <sighs> Feels nice to stretch, stretch out after a long session of stabbing monsters while I'm a dagger. I'm more focused, but more tense. You enjoy it though, right? Yeah. 
Christ, why do you think I'm here? The pay isn't that great. She nudges you playfully and sits on the fountain's edge. Would you like to offer a ghost? I don't think I have anything she would like. You said not to do it. We sit together in a companionable Thanks. silence. Slime. Time for a little self-indulgence, right? You said in the they begin to vibrate. <sighs> Need your back. Let's see. Too soon as every feel more relaxed. Valerie stretches with a happy hmm. groan. Hey, monsters, use massage to relax a wallet. Definitely. <laughs> she loves mm -hmm. herself. All those weird vertebrae need special massage experts, I'm sure. So we chop them up. Let's go. Oh my god, they're strong here. Oh, I died. Let's play it safe for a minute. Oh yeah, I'm totally above playing safe. Dang, some of these enemies are like strong, dude. Oh, I leveled up quite a bit, so I guess that's good. Go home. <laughs> Go on in the ambulance. Okay, so you and a plus one are invited to my what? I had an idea. You like museums? Actually, I do like museums. And museums are actually pretty dope and are actually pretty cool and stuff like that. So I genuinely like them. And he doesn't mind if you're dating someone else, no big deal. You're gonna invite him anyway. You're gonna invite anyone? Uh. Uh, I don't really know if I'm gonna invite anyone, um, nah. Well, he changed your mind. Told him to bring something to haha, -ha, see you tomorrow. Yeah! Meet me at the museum. Where's something red? Uh, sure? Ha, just getting whatever you want. Should I wear red? People get mad about this game and all, but it's like, where else are you supposed to keep a boyfriend? <laughs> well, um... It's more like, well, it's like you're dating a weapon. Like, uh, people are able to transform into weapons. Fried mackerel recipe, pepperoni pizza. I want to make a pepperoni pizza, why not? Ta-da! Fried mackerel. Why not? I have no clue who would like this, but I mean... Fashion design recipe. I guess I'll leave. Let's go. Let's see, and she leads huh? you to the museum. In the first gallery, Valeria glares daggers at one of the sculptures. Lol, funny. She glares daggers and she's a dagger. It's too perfect. Perfection is so boring. I don't trust it. Saying I'm not perfect. Beauty is boring. Uh, I prefer paintings. Yeah, beauty is boring. Mm -hmm. Exactly right. Perfect symmetry, leave it to the mathematician's essay. Valerie guides you through the museum without a map, according to her whim. Would you like to offer a gift? I don't think I have anything she would like. She talks about the art with intimate fondness, like their eccentric family oh. members. Just wondering, if you could steal a painting from any museum, which one would it be? That's a loaded question. <laughs> That's a loaded question. I know they're my favorite kind of questions. You never really thought about it before. I'd steal the birth of Venice by... Okay, it's in the- I can't say any of these ground floor near the <sighs> stairs. The real issue is the size. It's by 3 by 2.18. It would be a crime to roll it up. Stealing it? It is a crime! Uh, you've thought this through. Well, it wouldn't do to get caught, would it? Are you serious? Yeah. About not getting caught? Deadly serious. Now it's your turn. What, what would you liberate? 
And then she's, uh, Klimt's okay summer day. Actually, I think I like this one if I remember what it is correctly. Skulls and flowers. Yeah, I can see that one speaking to you. I hate museums as much as I love the idea of them anyway. Art should be free out in the world, not hidden away <sighs> like this. The Vernon Beach isn't so bad. The museum's free and open to the public. Have you heard about the new mural at the mall? Maybe we can go look at it together sometime. I'd love to know what you think. People are saying it's Rose is of Venice, you know, the anonymous graffiti artist. Maybe they're thought Verona Beach needed a little more beauty and love. Hmm. Just as you're getting to know her better, Valeria's attention wanders. Look around to see what's distracting her and wait. It's the guy from the park. He's standing at the gallery interest. Galeria, you um. I'm so sorry. I'll take care of this. She grabs the guy by the shoulder and pulls him away. She whispers to him. They look intimate. Like they've known each other forever. After a few moments, returns looking flush ah. and angry. You want to get out of here? You mean go home with you? What happened to romance? Uh... You mean go home with you? Yeah. Yeah, that's what you want to uh, get out of here generally means. <laughs> okay. So what do you say? Hell yeah. So, uh, I just want to be friends, probably. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, okay, probably for the best, right? The company is you through the rest, but she seems <laughs> preoccupied. I'll call you. Eventually you head home. I'm just like, let's just be friends. I'm not ready yet. Who do you invite to Jesse's barbecue? Uh, nobody? He decided to go alone. On the way over, we pick up something to share. Soda, cheesies. Uh, I don't really bring. Maybe it's sweet. You worry it's not good enough. We'll just see that if you buy it anyway. Cake seems like a safe bet. Everyone likes cake. You close your. And hope tonight goes well. You're hearing Jesse's doorbell, but nobody answers. You hear the sound of talking and music from the backyard. You go hey, around back it's to my coolest cousin. Oh, I want to be friendly, okay? Two strangers look at you and raise a glass. Oh, you brought warm. cake. Perfect. We needed something sweet. So I know mostly everyone gets soda. So it is like a pretty girl's hot. You're here. Everything's going according to plan. Mm. I gotta get the burger. In the meantime, meet Jenna here. Go talk. Let's see. Joe, Jesse pushes pushes a stranger towards you with a wink and walks away. Um, hi, I'm Jonah. Shoot, you knew that already. <laughs> Sounds awkward, that's funny. Can you become a sword? <laughs> that's me! Yeah. Cool. Well, uh, so that's us. You said I'm really both trying to think of something to say. Uh, what do you do? I do a lot of surfing and hanging out, mostly. Some reading, too. Oh, oh neat. Wait, do you mean for work? I don't really have a job right now. Just said you is that right? So you're some kind of hero? Ah! It's very- it's no big deal, it pays as well. <laughs> this is exactly what a hero would say, I'm on to you. I've been thinking about trying the dungeon out myself sometime, maybe. Just said you wield, um, weapons down there. I can sometimes be an axe, I don't often do it, though. Oh, that's amazing! <laughs> Thanks, it doesn't take much effort, though. I just decided to change shape like clenching a fist. Maybe I'll show you sometime. Anyway, I could definitely use the money from a gig, uh, but you promise we won't hurt anyone, like not even animals. Only monsters. And who decides what's an animal or a monster, I wonder. But I don't really have a choice. I wish I wasn't hurting so bad for money. Here's my number. Maybe we can go together sometime. Or if you want to hang out, like as humans, I'm usually. Ah, oh, sounds good. Eric elbows his. Ugh, get out of here, Eric. <laughs> Why do you ruin the vibe all the time? Oh. Hello. May I kiss your hand? No thanks. <laughs> Eric gives you a deep formal bow. <laughs> that glances between you and Eric. Hey Eric, I didn't know you'd be here. You don't seem the patriotic type. Well, I heard that Lucio Cinnamon would be here, so I had to make an appearance. Uh, with the romance of the barbecue and fireworks, I thought this might be my chance. Real subtle, bro. Ha, uh, subtle is for combat business. Love is an entirely different battlefield. Mm. And I intend to bring all my cannons to bear on my target. I'm not a target, not interested. Your metaphor is terrible. <laughs> I'm not a target. Mm. Oh, of affection you are, my sweet. Is my shovel to set? No. No. Party music plays from speakers. Everyone starts talking louder. <sighs> Eric shudders as if in deep pain. Ear poison, I cannot stand modern music. It robs the moment of any elegance. I like this music, it's very tight. Give my regards to Jess, Ian, Samantha, I must flee. Eric hurries away and hands over his ears. Are you okay, Cinnamon? Eric really gets to you, huh? I'm fine, thanks. I hate him. Uh, 
I'm thanks. Fine, thanks. You realize you're lightly trembling with suppressed feelings. Where does your confidence go? Like, I try to like everyone, but sometimes it's hard, huh? Eric, Jesse, and I went to school together. He doesn't have a bad heart. I think he's just lonely. That doesn't give him the right to be a jerk, but I wish he would grow up. I have enough problems. That's a nice thought. He'll never understand. It's a nice thought. Yeah. Well, it's probably just a thought. I don't know if it, he can be helped, honestly. Yeah, he goes by with lively conversation. You eat burgers and grill portobellos, steadily walking the line between satisfaction and gluttony. At one point, the music is turned down and everyone quiets watching the fireworks. Ha! Huh, sick. As the sky explodes, you feel a romantic energy. It's, let's see. Energy surge through. You have to kiss Joe and resist. I'm gonna resist. Take a deep breath in another, then pulse passes and the fireworks end. Someone turns the music back on. Those are some explosions, all right. Now back to partying. Bye. See ya. Bye. You say goodnight to Jesse and Jonah's shuffle home. Nice meeting. It'd be fun to talk more sometime. Ah, oh, cool beans. So how was the barbecue? It's so romantic, right? Um, dang. Yep, yeah, but I just remember I'm out of town for the rest of the summer. Oh, that sucks. Uh, nah. Well, I am. I tried my best. And you seem like you're happy, so... Honestly, I consider my job here done. You had some great folks going on some dates. I think I can back off and let you do your thing for the rest of the summer. Is that okay? Sure. I'm doing fine. I'm like, cool, now we can just be normal friends and cousins. Oof. Love you, cuz. Talk to you later. Okay, talk to you later. You up? Morning? Thanks for making the museum more fun. Then I may be- then I maybe made it awkward. I want to see you again, but I need to think. Let's just, uh, dungy for a while. Yeah. Excuse me. Nice meeting to see, um, but I just remember I'm out of town for the rest. Aww. I'm sad face. <laughs> yeah, sorry, maybe we can <laughs> connect again somehow someday. If you ever come back to town in the fall, maybe I can show you some surfing spots on the island. What island? Verona Island, the very is under repairs right now though. Oh well. I hope your summer in VB is the best. Thanks. Think we'll meet again somehow sooner than we think. All right, that'd be cool. Cool, cool. I like you better than this fucking asshole. It's <laughs> annoying as shit. I don't like him. He's like the high and mighty type, and like I can probably tell him no like a hundred times, and he won't get the hit. 